morning, it's day six of eight. Thank God, not seven. <laughs> and now I am in the gym. And we're about to pull up to NASA. And uh, so I'm gonna get a little workout in, maybe get some footage in. And um, then go around about our day. Hopefully a lot of people will leave and so we can enjoy the pool. And it um, looks like a beautiful day out, so no rain or anything, so it should be good. And um, should be pretty empty ship, I hope. We are in NASA. Oh, look at that. You got MSC. You got a Symphony of the Seas, Royal Caribbean over here. I saw Carnival somewhere. Maybe they're on the other side. Let's go see. Oh, I see a whale tail. I do, I do. Who do we have over there? Conquest. Got a carnival conquest there. I don't know. I might come out to the port. We'll see. But this uh, Serenity is empty, so that looks super duper right now. I might just stay here. It's really lovely. What a beautiful day. I also did a um, morning stretch. By the way, um, here you have two free classes every day, the morning stretch and fab abs. I wasn't brave enough for the abs. I'm really, really sore to the exercise I did yesterday. So, um, that was the day before. But anyways, I'm still really sore. So I wasn't brave enough for it. Maybe I will be brave enough tomorrow or the day after, but today is not the day. So today I'd be lazy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm probably gonna go do some weights with some weight training and then I'll go get some snacks and get Adam up and then we'll start our day I just finished finally working out and look at this look at this it's raining that really sucks I guess we'll do stuff indoors. The man over there is brave. He's gonna get soaked. Oh well, hopefully it won't be all day. Hopefully it will stop soon so that we could enjoy the poor day on the ship. We'll see. Time to get breakfast. So we went to Iguana and we got a burrito this time to try and um, some fruit and french toast and all the fixings and some orange juice and we're gonna share the burrito because it's so big so that's exciting yay the breakfast was amazing now we're going up to serenity and we're gonna lay out over there look there's no one in the pool either it is such a beautiful day i'm so glad it quit raining and the sun came out really nice Look guys, there's literally nobody here. All of these clamshells are empty. The sun is on the side, so I'm gonna go try to see if I could get me a um, a clamshell or something on the shady side so that we don't get burned. And I also got a book from the library yesterday. So I'm trying to, to read it. If I can stop looking at beams for a minute <laughs> while we have internet, so. What a beautiful day. And here, look, the Atlantis Resort. Have the Symphony of the Seas, the Magnifica. It's such a pretty day. This is so nice. We are the only people in Serenity. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. That pool would be real busy. <laughs> yeah. It's awesome. <laughs> See how tiny that ship is. Apparently, uh, there was some fight, according to our Facebook page and this uh, ship's cruise uh, Facebook page, and um, a group of people was kicked off the ship this morning in NASA, uh, and with suitcases and everything. Right? What else happened? What they What they say? So there was a fight, and then someone saw a bunch of people getting off the of suitcases. Interesting. So it must have Very interesting. Trying to get in the pool. There's no one there hardly. It's nice. Really good. And we got here. 
at a Red Frog uh, rum bar has a really delicious drink called Ting Mojito. So it's like a mojito, but made with Jamaican ting, which is grapefruit soda, and it's absolutely yummy. You should try it if you haven't yet. Hi. Just Adam with his wonderful go smile. Go straight down. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody here. It's so nice. Full of spleen. The only um, complaint is that you see here how like the level is right here. And it would be a whole lot cooler if it was up to here, so you could lay out. That way you could fit a whole lot more people, you know, to lounge and lay in the water without having to get in the pool. Um, but, you know, it is what it is. All right, guys, we're going to open. And it was so nice, and I uh, have a half empty pool, not even half, like. So three people in it. So now we're gonna go grab some lunch. I think that's my last chance to get some Mongolian walk, so I'm gonna use that opportunity. We'll go back. Okay. I'll wait for you. Uh so um we're gonna go do that because tomorrow is gonna be sea day and it's gonna be really, really busy for the next two days. So we'll go do that now. It was delicious last time I had it. I absolutely love it. So I got today, uh which I never usually get, salmon. Salmon with yeah. my noodle. Um, never ever get it uh, with Szechuan sauce. I don't know how that's going to taste, but hey, I'm here. Might as well try it. Uh, should be pretty good. So I'm excited to see where that's going to come out. Like, I'm so full and so happy. And now we're going to go take a nap because today, today's spa day. Today I'm getting my keratin treatment on my hair and Adam's getting his pedicure. Really important, really fun time at 3.30. So I'm gonna go take a little nap before and relax. That machine wasn't working. That was just so we got to another one. There you go. It works. It's Mick Ultra, but it works. Whoa. You could not be a bartender. <laughs> there you have it. It's spa time. So time to get my Keratin uh, Express blowout. So this is what it's looking like now. Okay. Let's see what it's going to happen in uh, an hour and a half. We're waiting. We've been checked in. Yeah. So, how excited are you? From one to ten. Nine point nine. That's excited. That's his first one, first pedicure ever. The process has begun. Okay, but, and now we're gonna cool off a little bit and do the haircut next. It's gonna be a little trim. I'm keeping the leg. Let's go. Yeah, let's go do this. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. I want to be featured in the video. Okay. <laughs> yeah. All right. That's the man that made the magic yes. happen. Yes. Oh, hello. <laughs> All the way from Carnival Dream. Yes. <laughs> look, look, look. Yes. So we have Elise over here. Elise, right? Elise. Yeah, Elise. Yeah, Elise. She's got beautiful, nice hair now. We did keratin for her and some face framing layers. She looks absolutely stunning. And she's ready to flaunt. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Thank you so Thank much. You so much.
Thank you. We're um, in the My hair is done, we're over here in Alcana Bar, and I am trying a um, restorative basil drop, and Adam's having a revved up mojito martini yeah. in the regular glass, so it's easy to carry. Yeah, you can't carry a drink in a martini glass. I love my hair, by the way. Oh my gosh, I highly recommend it. So, after $50, uh, off that I got from the spa, the gift certificate, fifty dollars off, and after the eighteen percent gratuity um, that was added on, it was one hundred sixty-one dollars. Um, so it was like one hundred and twenty something, and then thirty thirty-one some dollar uh, eighteen percent gratuity that they added. But he also gave me a free haircut, so I added a little extra to him too. But anyways, an amazing deal for an amazing uh, stylist, an amazing like results. I'm so happy with that, right, Adam? Yeah. Yeah, he said it's the best my hair ever looked. Um, and you spend a lot more back home, so this is really awesome. I am so pleased. I cannot explain it. Thank you, Carnival. Thank you for fifty dollars off, and you got a pedicure for fifty dollars off. So if you attend those raffles. They will give you $50 off even if you don't win stuff. They'll just call you and tell you you got like, they'll give you a, um, a secret or raffle where you win like, they give you $50 off uh, either hair, nails, or massage, or like one of those uh, beautifying treatments. So it's worth it. And the quality is really good. Every time I ever have anything done on the ship, it's always stuff that, like last time I had my nails done, that gel manicure lasted for like three weeks, not even a single chip. It was unbelievable. It was definitely worth the money. So, super pleased with everything. Oh, and Adam got me earrings. He got me earrings while I was getting my uh, hair done. And it stopped raining us. And they're made out. They're made out of nuts. <laughs> they're made handmade out of nuts. Thank you. Oh, that's different today. Yes. And nice. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> we got Good. different bread today. Cranberry bread. Oh, nice. That's where we've been hearing things about it. rising bread. Or yeah, we are in the dining room and, uh, yeah, with all of our fabulousness today. <laughs> with this pedicure my hair. <laughs> Anyways, um, exciting menu. I'm going to get some... Seafood Newberg. I'm not sure what that is, but I'm excited to try it. And then some dill lemon soup and uh, antipasti from Emerald's menu. And Adam's going to have a potato soup and uh, a lasagna from the appetizers menu, the half portion. And then turkey, the doing turkey today for an entree, so he's going to have some of that. And I'm sure you're going to do that dessert. What is that? The Dutch chocolate something? Yeah. Volcano thing. I don't know. What is it called? Dutch chocolate. Oh, uh, yeah. I'm going to do that. Yeah. Yeah. It's, uh, it was raining earlier, and it stopped now, so I can't go outside. I have to keep my hair dry for eight hours. I'll be walking around checking every mirror <laughs> for the next two days. Uh-huh. He's already making fun of me. Oh, well, I took pictures because it looks really good. Yeah. Talk about how wonderful it is. Her hair looks better than my hair. That's That says a lot. <laughs> All right, let's order our dinner. Look how many cranberries are in this bread. That's a lot. <laughs> what? It's a lot of cranberries. That's a ton. Yeah. Potato food. Turkey dinner. Turkey, turkey. And mine is seafood uh, from Newburg. That's a I have no silverware. Pastry. Oh, we'll take one from there. That's dirty. It's clean. It's brand new. Is it? It's a clean setting. 
Yes. Adam got a Dutch chocolate thing. And look, he um, not on purpose, made a little cruise ship. Oh, <laughs> he made a little cruise ship. I got a lime for bag. So we're sitting here talking about how, how like my hair guy that was telling my hair was asking me what my favorite thing to do on a cruise, and I said mostly eat like this we love here because we starve like i said before like in a, in a separate video we usually quit eating like a couple of weeks before and uh, on this facebook group because we're gonna go on a regal princess in december somebody already posted i used i used like don't want to uh, quit eating yet or what did they say are you starving i don't remember what's are you starving yet yeah because if you go to regal princess like when we went last time I don't think we could eat for weeks afterwards. Like we were just so sad leaving, and we're like, "How are we gonna like go and back and out into the world and survive?" <laughs> so apparently, that person already has been on that cruise because they start starting their starvation months <laughs> in advance. Normally, we start about like three weeks ahead of time. These people are like three months. <laughs> Anyways. That's funny. The artwork here is wonderful. <laughs> it's so different and cute. And so it means that I will be the one who's gonna take good care of you while you're here. Here comes my reminders. If you have kids with you, please remain them seated and please make sure that they will behave during